Birthday time again, eh? Damn. Time really flies too damn fast, doesn't it? Hey, make yourself useful and let's celebrate, I guess. I did say you could follow me, so... Come along now. What, you wanna waste all day just wondering? No. If I'm gonna celebrate my birthday with you, we're gonna make it something worth remembering. You're not gonna complain about that, are you? Come on. You know better than that. Do I ever disappoint? <laughs> you and your wild presumption is of me. You ever get tired of looking up to me that much? Because <laughs> I guess I'm not getting tired of you being a pain in my ass. No. Oh. What's with that bird brain look? Come on. You know better than to do. On my birthday of all things, come on. Really? Whatever. Kid, you got a lot to learn. Not that I'm the best teacher or anything. Besides, kid, you never really explained things too well, did you? Just walking up to me last time, you took a big risk there. What's to say I didn't turn you over to something? I may have a reputation, but... You think I can't break it? Eh, whatever. At this point, I guess I'm stuck with you. You're my pain in the ass now. So, what are we gonna do about that? If you ask me, I'd say that what you're looking for is some training, some practice like last time. Main difference? This time I'm not holding back. So, birthday boy's wish. Why don't you come with me, hang out for the day? Yeah, could be sarcastic. Guess you'll have to find out. You wanna know why I'm always like that? Cause life has given me so much shit, I don't know what's true and what's not. How do I know I can trust you? <laughs> you say it like it's so easy. Don't be conceited. You know as good as I do. This life's way too short for that. Besides, I can't be sure until I test you out. Oh, you think that was truth? Well, I guess you'll have to find out the old-fashioned way, won't you? No, by looks of it, you're gonna be an interesting one to the very end, aren't you? <laughs> I don't mind that. In fact, I'm kind of interested in how far you're gonna follow me and when you're gonna give up. No, oh, you will give up. They all do. Don't be too self-conscious now. <laughs> Thinking that I'm bluffing? And why would I do that, kid? Oh, really? You want to talk all that crap about it, but what do you got to show? You're the one coming to me. I'm not saying I'm perfect, kid. Anything but. With my past, my demons, even if I do accept them, what does it really change anything? Yeah, I'm a man at the top. One that doesn't want to be. One that doesn't care about all that. I... I fake it. I'm a classic case of fake it till you make it. So to hear you praising me on my birthday... Just cut it out. No, I'm not saying you have to stop, but... I'm saying it doesn't have any meaning yet, since you don't really know me. You know what you want to see. You see exactly what's in front of you. How much more do you know about me, Pipsqueak? Didn't think so. So, what are you planning on doing today, anyways? You had a plan for my birthday? That's definitely something more than I expected. Perhaps you're not so hopeless after all. What is it? <laughs> Could you be any more childish with it? 
And I'm not offending you, am I? Am I being honest? <laughs> no. I'm not saying it's a bad thing. In fact, why I call you kid even though I don't know your age? I don't care. You act like one, so that's what you get. Hate me for it? That'd be an interesting turn of events, wouldn't it? Suddenly you hate your idol. Isn't it strange? Idols aren't what we think they are, are we? No, that doesn't seem to be stopping you. Not that it that I expected much of anything to stop you. Nah. You don't seem the type to give up that easy. I'll give it to you, kid. You're determined like I used to be. Why do I talk like I'm so damn old when I'm not? Maybe it's because I feel like I am. I feel like my demons are such a pain in the ass that when I have to deal with something extra like you, I just end up... Thinking, well, I really need a nap. And where's the nap on my birthday? What kind of depressed son of a bitch would I be if I napped on my birthday? Yeah, maybe I am, maybe I'm not. Guess we'll have to see how much you bore me. No, no, you're not hopeless. Not by a long shot. Just kind of pathetic. You're working on it, right? So who cares? Who cares what anyone thinks? I sure as hell don't. And if you look up to me, you probably don't either. You wouldn't be here if you just wanted to be every other hero or villain. No. You want something more. Celebrating my birthday, though, humanizes you a bit. Yeah, yeah. You're something else, kid. Guess we just have to decide if that's a good thing or a bad one. That's all up to you. Because the way I see it, you're a blank slate. You never really had that much going for you. Luckily, you didn't have much going against. I don't see any debts. I don't see any things beyond what I'm looking at right now. So I guess that makes us even. Because you don't know a damn thing about me. And that's fine. Maybe you'll learn. Maybe you'll stick around for all this bullshit and get through it. I wonder. You got it in you, kid? Guess it's pointless to ask you when you don't even know yourself. Oh, no, no, no. Don't say anything like that. That'd make you a liar. Because I can see it. The back of those eyes? You're doubting yourself. So why? I gotta ask, but you don't have a good answer. There's so many things you can tell by just looking into someone's eyes. Tell me, what do you see inside mine? Is it a cocky bastard at the top of the world? Or someone with a lot more... troubles? <laughs> yeah. Take of it what you will. It's not gonna change anything that quick. Sorry to say, but the world isn't like that. The world doesn't just bend knee because you want it to. You gotta make it. You know, that's why I've done some things that I'm not proud of, but you know what? We all have those. Things we don't like. Things we can't stand about ourselves. Things that make us stay up at night. But isn't that part of life? <laughs> Who doesn't have regrets? I just make good on mine. If I got him, you better believe I'm going to change him, bend him, to my will. Oh, and while I'm at it, might as well make something special. Here, you can have it. I do it when I'm wasting time. I make some origami cranes. They say if you make enough of them, you get a wish. My wish? Wouldn't you like to know? Sorry, kid. Can't give out that kind of information to just anyone. Besides, you seem like you're all kinds of willing to compromise, and you even accepted a birthday gift on my birthday. Well, I guess it wasn't a birthday gift, but... Oh, got something for me? Sure, go ahead. 
I'm not going to turn down a gift from someone like you. You're just simple enough to actually have some worth with it. What's this? Hand-drawn card. I don't know if you met someone who told you something about me, or if you just had a lucky guess. Man, I don't know. I'm starting to doubt myself here. Uh, well. Thanks, kid. Yeah, I like it a lot, actually. Like a hell of a lot. The fact that you took some time out of your day to make it, even if it was ten minutes, five, I still like it. It means more to me than empty money. <laughs> those green dollar bills, those yen signs. I get tired of looking at them. Something simple like this suits you. Don't stop being that kind of person, kid. Don't. Deal? All right. Now, what's this I hear about a birthday party? I better not be one with any clowns. Keep them out of here. We have a deal? Not bad. Making me make deals. <laughs> You've got guts, kid. Guts, and I'm not sure if it's gonna damn you or help you out. <laughs> but I'm dying to find out. You're fun to be around, that's more than I can say about 99% of people. So you better not stop being fun. Change isn't always a good thing. Remember that. Unless you want me to have to remind you, kid. I don't think either of us want that. I mean, you'd probably get a kick out of it, but... Why would I want to waste my time doing that? You're already a pain in my ass. <laughs> But I guess I don't mind it all the time. Look at you. Changing how I view this miserable world just a little bit. Guess that's a birthday miracle, as far as I'm concerned. You've already done more than most could. <laughs> Give me a break here, kid. Always trying to make your point. And yet, <laughs> why is it I can't get enough of you? You're entertaining. Hey, let's not jump the boat yet. I don't know how I really feel about you. That's why I was honest last time. You expect me to lie? Sorry, no. That's not what I do. At least, not unless I have no other way. I like to avoid such unsettling things like lies. They suck ass. And frankly, I don't have the time for them. Why would I? All these fake people all around. Why would I want to be like them? Hell, even my buddy Endeavor. As much as I admire him in the spotlight, I don't like him. And, well, I appreciate him. I'm not sure if I'd consider him a true friend anymore. After all that's happened, I guess I realized... Even he's skirting the line between hero and villain. That I appreciate, mind you, but the rest of it... I'm just not sure where I stand on all of it. It's like this big empty feeling in my heart, and I just... I get stuck up on things. What can I say? Flapping around, being the speedy man I am. Doesn't always come with a guidebook. Especially not with my choice of... Where I stand with a lot of things. It's kind of like asking for problems. You know how often people come at me? Both sides. They want to take me down. The one because I'm too high at the heroes. The next one because I'm too high at the villains. What am I really? An anomaly that rides the edge of both sides. And what does it matter? Who's going to stop me? No one. I can't even stop myself. Maybe that's the poetic justice of it. Part of me wants to. <laughs> not because it's what I believe in or not because it's what I think I need. No, no, no. It's nothing as convoluted as that. I just want a break. 
Maybe you're that kid, teaching you. Maybe you really can be a sidekick to me. I wonder, though. You seem like you're the type that might, but... I don't know. You really got what it takes? I'm not convinced yet. Remember that part when I said that I wanted to make a lot of money and sit on my ass? Well, it's only partially true. At this point, money seems kind of cheap if you know what I'm talking about. After I got it in my hands, I, I did just that. I got hella boring just waiting here. What am I waiting on? Until I can't move anymore? Wasting my youth like that? Yeah, not too fond of the idea of it. Not at all. So I changed. Just a bit. Oh, I changed. I compromised. I made things just a bit different. And it blew up in my... F I'm not even gonna say it. Pisses me off just thinking about it. Now, if we're gonna have a happy birthday here, we might as well go to an actual place that serves food or something. My treat. Yeah. Yeah, just... just... Forget about it, kid. There's no sense in you getting all worked up over it when I... I dug my own grave. I'll tell you about it later. No. Just relax. Take my hand and we'll be there in a jiffy. What? Think you're faster? Don't make me laugh now. <laughs> you did anyways. Guess I should have expected that. Pain in the ass once is a pain in the ass always, right? Oh no, not complaining me. What do you take me for? Someone who wastes his time complaining? Lazing about in the back of an alleyway that just kind of kicks it and relaxes? Yeah. Well, I guess that's just about me, so... Ah, whatever. You don't seem to mind it, so... Let's make it a birthday to remember. Where you wanna eat, kid? Yeah, yeah, I could go anywhere I want. Anywhere I damn well please. But that doesn't mean that I could choose something as unique as you probably could. I usually go with habits. <laughs> Bad habits at that. Might as well choose something different. Choose something new. Go ahead. Oh, come on. You can do better than that, can't you? Give me a break here. You don't actually intend to take me to... Touche. You surprised me. Let's try it. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? I mean, sure, waste my time? As if that matters at this point. My time's not worth very much. In fact, I'd welcome any diversions at the moment. You want to know more about me, don't you? What? I can read you like a book. Don't even try and stop me from doing it. What are you going to do? Hide your eyes behind sunglasses? I'd still get it from your body language. You want to know all about me? You're a strange one, kid. You know that? Not just anyone's interested in hawks. My name? What does that have to... <laughs> Everyone always wants to know. Fancy that. You're like everyone else in some ways. Glad to know you're still human. Where are you? I wonder. <laughs> Anyways, it's... Uh, it's Keigo. Keigo Takami. You got a problem with it? No, didn't think so. Just asking to be sure, because you had that look on your face of... Something crossed between a... Admiration of my name and being shocked that I actually told you. Which is more... Your good luck, I guess. Now be thankful. Give me praise. Give me gifts. Yeah, yeah. Yada yada. So excited. Can't you see it on my face? So excited. Like I said, kid, I can't answer that. I know what you're asking again. You want to know how I feel about you? Sorry. 
That's a complicated thing to answer. Do I look like I have the energy or time to waste with something complicated right now? You know what, I'll humor you. Because you're a good kid. And what I said before, the reason why I was telling you to stop, is because you might discover something about your idol that might make me not your idol. You might turn that love into hatred real quick like the rest of them did. Say you're different than the others is still a big step, you know. That's a big step that nobody's taken. What makes you think you're so different anyways? You think every single other person who asked for it didn't think that they were different? Everyone thinks they're different. Everyone thinks they're special. And what does that leave them? Where does it lead them? It usually leads them down a path to discovering something they don't like. And for what? One indeed. Oh, you'd like to know. I can see it. But this sarcastic asshole is still not quite ready to tell you, so uh, do be patient now. Maybe I'll tell you if you're a good little kid. What? Nickname pissing you off? Deal with it. Makes me laugh. I'm not a sadist or anything, but... I call people as I see them. You're gonna get left in the dust over there. You really want me to do that? No. I know what you want. <clears throat> I'll do you a little fan service here. Stop squirming. I picked you up in my arms for a reason. Huh? You want more, don't you? Stingy. You know what? I'll give it to you, kid. You're just about interesting enough that I could spend a lot of time around you. Possibly not even get bored then. But what you're asking... You're asking for a lot of things. And I'm not so sure you want the answers. Sometimes they're not as romantic. What if I'm a scoundrel? You still gonna say you wanna be near me? Still gonna say you like me? Part of me just doesn't get you, kid. But I'm not that easy to capture. This bird flies free. What you gonna do about it? That's what we gotta figure out now. Isn't it? You're awfully cute when you're frustrated. Now why don't I show you... How fast the Hawks Express can go. Well, making you feel a bit more embarrassed. <laughs> I stole that one from you because you were looking at me dumbfounded. How's it feel, the Princess Carrie embarrassed yet? <laughs> I sure hope so. It's fun to embarrass you. Now shut up and let me do whatever I want. You worship me, so it shouldn't be any problem, right? This sarcastic asshole's gonna do exactly what he does best. Make you all kinds of flustered. Yeah, yeah, you made your point. Now just relax. There's no sense in all of this fighting. You just fighting something you believe in. Why don't you just admit it? You're head over heels for me. Oh no, that'd be too easy, wouldn't it? I wish I could say the same. No, it's nothing personal. I... I'm just not sure I... I'd be very good for you. I have a lot of... A lot of cares and... Uh, I don't like letting people down. I also don't want to betray your trust in me. That belief, it's uh, pressure, you know. I don't want to mess it up. So, pardon if it takes me a bit to consider anything like that. I've been stabbed in the back and had a broken heart a whole bunch of times, so I'll just make sure that, that we take things slow, if that's even how things go for us. I know what you must think of me. I'm probably that guy who people tell you to stay away from. Hey... Hit the nail right on the head, right? That's not how I exactly planned on it being. 
things don't go as I plan usually. Just like my past doesn't go away just like that. If you're patient enough, maybe you'll get to know me. Maybe you'll get to really know me. Maybe we'll be more than just strangers and we'll get to see each other in a new light. Never know. This sarcastic bastard might just be what you need. Maybe I'll live up to those expectations. Or maybe I'm just a bastard. A monster. Playing with your heart? <laughs> Saying it doesn't suit me. You'd be surprised how many people would disagree. Ah, oh, whatever, kid. You're a headache, but I love it. Wonder if that makes me <laughs> messed up in the head or not. Some part of me doesn't care. But, what can I say? I'm not here to play around with you, and that's why I can't give you the all clear. It'd be stupid of me. Selfish. Done it before. But I'm not one who likes to play with people's hearts unlike some cruel motherfuckers. Believe it or not, I absolutely despise people who do things like that. It's not even because of me. No, not my own experiences. Nothing so petty as that. I just don't like seeing people sad like that. Maybe it's all that hero stuff got to me. Or maybe it's that I actually help people for some reason that isn't just lazing around on my butt. You know, I used to be so superficial. I probably still am. It makes me kind of cringe. At the same time, it's just who I am. Not anymore so much as before, but I'll be damned if I don't try and make things into my own little pea pod, my own little, I don't know, my own little garden of sorts. I like things to be unpredictable and fun, but then I'm contradicting myself so royally, and I also like it to be orderly. I don't like stepping on people to get to places. Seriously, who likes that in the first place? Even among villains, most of them got a heart. So why would I want to be an outlier even among them? Not unless I got a death wish. <laughs> Besides, I don't think it suits me. None of this does. It's madness to think that you've even stuck with me this far. You know what? I can't even slate you. You've got your own reasons, and I've got mine, so why don't we see how far this little rabbit hole goes? Looks like we're here, too. <laughs> Taking me to a burger joint? You've got some nerve about you, don't you? You think I can take all that grease? Well, you're on. We'll see who can eat the most burgers, and... By the end of it, if you're crying to your mommy, don't blame me. <laughs> ah, you got a funny expression, don't you? Maybe it's just your face. You got a case of RBF? I don't know. Hard to say. You can't tell when someone's messing around with you, can you? Sorry. Forgot about that. You're too easy to tease. Guess, uh, maybe we do get along. As long as you don't mind being teased to the ground and, you know, the rest of the nonsense. <laughs> it's what I do. But you already know that. You've known that from the start, haven't you? It's just what I do. Teasing, having fun, being lazy. You're the one who forced me to do all this, you know. Hope you're happy. But... <sighs> It is kind of nice having someone to celebrate my birthday with. Considering there's been no one for a long time. I don't know. Just feels kind of surreal. Didn't expect you to actually have this much interest in me. Nor did I expect me to tolerate you this long. Guess there's a bunch of miracles going on all at once that I can't really blame on anyone but you. Congratulations. You've made some exceptions to things, haven't you? 
I can't complain. Guess I'm getting good things out of it, too. Not too shabby there, kid. You really do gotta learn. You can't trust scoundrels. You're lucky it's me you've put all this in. Otherwise, you might be in a lot worse situation. What if I sold you off for your organs or something? Hmm? Yeah? You got a contingency plan for that? Nah, I didn't think so. Don't feel bad. I wouldn't do that to you. Wait, let's see. Uh, no, no, just uh, measuring up, just in case. What, I need my own contingency plan. If someone holds this up and I need to use a sacrifice, you'd be my willing sacrifice, wouldn't you? That's right. <laughs> the look on your face, it's so priceless. Nah. A scoundrel, if I'm going down, I'm not going down without a fight. If I have time to waste on using someone as a hostage... And I'm not me anymore. What would I be if I wasn't a big dumbass, just like I said I was? You know, me being the biggest dumbass in the world and all that, it does come with some perks. I got to meet someone I find irresistible in their own way. Yeah, that someone's you. Table for two, please. Um... Okay, um, you said two? Yeah, and make it snappy. You new here or something? It, um, right this way. Here's your table. Um, your server's gonna be right here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. That is for you. <laughs> is that a tinge of jealousy? Why would you bother? Do I look interested in no-confidence waitresses? <laughs> Sorry. That's not my thing. I'm afraid I like your confidence a lot more. Besides, people like her. You know why they got nothing on you? Because they can't speak their mind. You seem good enough at it, and I'll give you credit where it's due. You're fun to be around. That's more than most people can even beg to say. They want to be. They want to be interesting to me. They try. They try and buy my time. Doesn't work so well for them. I give them credit, though. There's a lot of people who seem desperate for me, and I like the attention, but it's just not the same as I get with you. My little... No, let me correct that. My favorite little waste of time. It's just for you. But hey, you aren't trying to be my sidekick, are you? Then, why don't you take this as a test? What would I order on my birthday? Well, yeah, the burgers we discussed already. That's cheating. No. What else? <laughs> Not half bad with your assumptions, but you know what they say about assumptions. Well, I'll leave it at that. You're not doing so bad for yourself. Makes me want to tease you, I'm not going to lie. But I'll let you off the hook for now, since you're so honest. Why don't I give you a kiss? You know, you always melt when I just <laughs> ask directly. Why is that? You just like someone to take control that much? I guess I am the manliest one. In a way. And what of it? You're always saying something, but... You get real quiet after I give you a few kisses. Better watch out. Kisses are dangerous. They might just make you have some feelings for me. What would you do then? No, in all seriousness. What are you going to do if you fall for me like you have already? But I mean deeper. What if you get it for me real bad? What's going to happen to you? I mean the way I see it, kid. You are damn f needy.
Not that I'm complaining. In fact, maybe you've infected me with whatever you got. I'm not gonna complain. You can do whatever you want. I'm not someone trying to control you. But I will say, for a pain in my ass, you're not too bad. In fact, I think you've got some redeeming qualities. The way you react when I kiss you. The way when I hold your face like this. You get all kinds of messed up. You get seven kinds of flustered and I just end up here laughing. It's not even that I'm making fun of you, you know. I'm laughing because I can't believe I have that effect on someone. Oh, would you look at that. Here we are again. You being like putty in my palm. And isn't that just how you want it to be? <laughs> Look at you. Every single time. Good thing I like that. Besides, here's the meal. <laughs> What's that gotten into you? Oh, don't tell me it's like that. You're getting flustered, frustrated, and otherwise... Waiting for me to do something more? Look at you. You're like a spitting image of someone I used to know. And yet no one's really been close enough that I could say that without, well, without it being partially a lie. I guess you really are the only one who ever did this. The only one stupid enough to love me. So earnestly. Not too shabby, I guess. Man, at the same time, it's kind of sad. What is it you see in me in the first place? I can't really understand it. You make no damn sense. Some part of me is okay with that. Eh, well, I guess if it's not broken, why fix it, right? I think as long as you're being true to yourself, kid, you can be whatever the f*** you want. As long as you're my ray of sunshine. As long as you don't forget what you are, where you stand with me, I'll take you higher than anyone else can. <laughs> Literally and figuratively. And that's just part of the draw of it. Dating the bad boy. That's what you want to do. Really, you want the birthday present to be me. I can tell. <laughs> Your intention isn't exactly easy. But it's something that's clear as day. Look at you. You're just like me. You're just like me from those years ago. Nah. Not in age, not in anything like that, but in heart. You're just like I used to be, damn. To think you'd be so caught up in things. You really don't care what society thinks of you, do you? I like it. I like it a lot. Definitely better than most would be. And I guess I could be a bit more... Cordial. Now the question is how much of me you can actually handle. I wonder about that. A lot of me makes me think it would be too much for you. Yet that expression you have? Nah. <laughs> not that easy, is it? You're not an easy one to break. But something tells me you want to find out. Fine. Just don't blame me. After you've discovered more than you're comfortable with. Oh, you want something like that, eh? Can't say I can always help you, but... My past is a dark place, honey. Not sure a kid like you would want to hear it. 
At the same time, maybe that's half the fun in it. We'll take our bill right now. Hey, you deaf or just blind? Yeah, I'll get you your bill now. <laughs> mean? <laughs> Me acting mean? I don't think it's mean if I'm calling someone out for not doing their job properly. New recruits gotta learn from someone. At least I'm not yelling at the poor thing. Thanks for worrying about someone like that, though. A lot of people have time for the little ones. Those that get stomped over by everyone else. You know? It's just kind of like those forgotten corners in a room that you just don't clean for a long time. Oh, just me? Well, I don't got a feather duster. Unless I use my feathers. It, look, it, it, it'd be more complicated than you know. Plus, who wants to dirty a feather? <laughs> now, shall we get going? I think that's what you've been <laughs> dying to ask me for. What? Another kiss? Of course I'd do it. Do I seem like I would ever not? And what would make you think that? <laughs> sly one. You're very sly. <laughs> you know just what to say sometimes, don't you? I guess it's a talent of yours. Not the best one, but... Why would you try and be the best with me around? You know you can. Oh, gonna beat me? I didn't take you for the type that's so loving competition, but you know what? I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. For now. Let's see what you got. This is my place. Penthouse of an office building. Not too shabby, right? I got the whole floor. No, uh, servants, though. I don't really like people in my business. What? Do you like them in yours? Yeah, yeah, I know that the maids and butlers and all that, it's all what people expect, right? I expect you to do that once you got the money. Well, I tried that life. Not really my cup of tea, I'm going to be honest with you. It wasn't as good as people say it you know, gets hyped up. But I'm not into that kind of thing, nah. I'd rather just have one person serve me. Maybe my sidekick? Maybe you doing something just for me? All the way up here? Nobody can hear you? <laughs> well, uh, if you put it that way... Remember... You said it, not me. <laughs> there you go again. Making things out to be all kinds of messed up. Uh, love is just a kiss away. You want me to say it, don't you? You want me to say everything. Well, maybe I do got a crush on you. And what's it to you? Huh? You gonna do something about it? Oh, really? Well, I'd be a liar if I said I wasn't interested in something my crush says. Maybe I do like you. Now why don't you find out? <laughs> Ah, putting up an attitude, are you? Yeah, think I can take you on? <laughs> Bold assumption. Too bad you're wrong. Whatever. You can handle me, just like you said. Then I'm waiting. <laughs> Getting shy now. Why would you bother doing that? Yeah. Well, what if I make you? It's only a joke, but... Oh! 
guess you took it literally. Mm, you've definitely got something. Guess I'll have trouble talking like that, but not that I'm complaining or anything. No. Well, I did say I might have a crush on you, so it's my own fault. And I'll take responsibility where responsibility is taken. Because you are my sidekick, so... Uh, talking too much? No, 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 no. I wouldn't dream of talking too much. I'm just mm, trying to, you know, make things a little bit more exciting, right? You know, you gotta talk it up. You gotta... Mm, yeah. But you knew that already. You know what you're getting yourself into? Mm. And you knew, uh, exactly what kind of roguish man I am, so, uh, well, uh, sorry, a little hard to think, but you're damn cute, I'll give it to you, now do you like me now, <laughs> look at you, always surprising me, I'll definitely give you credit for this, extra credit with that still. I am your teacher in a way, aren't I? <laughs> what, too many at once? <sighs> What's the matter? Can't handle me. I know you can. You're proving it right now, aren't you? <laughs> well, yeah. Maybe I do talk too much. Maybe I'm just a little bastard who doesn't know when to stop. And if I am, then I guess you'll have to deal with me too. Uh, is not what you wanted? You wanted this responsibility? You wanted me to be crazy about you? This is all just supposed to be a joke. And look at what you made of it. You made it something so much more than just a joke. I'm impressed. <clears throat> not so fast. Can't let you continue like that or things will be boring. Why don't we up the ante? We'll make things a competition. Go ahead. You can go back to things. Just don't mind me. <laughs> Definitely better with actions than words, aren't you? I'd say I'm the same. <laughs> What's so funny? Why, you are. You are way more excited about this than I thought you would be. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining. <laughs> I'd never complain about any of this. And that's because of you. <laughs> is that how it is? Look at you. <clears throat> Always the hard worker, aren't you? Not too bad. Not too bad at all. <laughs> Look at you. Look at how cute you've become. I'm impressed, honestly. Better than I expected. So far. <laughs> you didn't think that was all I got, did you? No. Not quite yet. Guess I'll have to make sure you know what you got yourself into now. <laughs> well, you know, you're mine, aren't you? Maybe, maybe not. Depends on if these feelings are real. <sighs> oh, getting too cheeky, aren't we? Fine by me. Just. Don't say I didn't warn you. Ah, that's the stuff, isn't it? Exactly what you bargained for? Nobody ever bargains for me. I'm 
more than anyone could imagine. This cocky bastard is maybe just a little too much. Hope you can handle me. I sure as hell can handle you. Guess we'll have to see who breaks first. That's the stuff, isn't it? <laughs> you did get what you asked for. Now don't regret it. Don't regret it at all. <laughs> don't get too crazy. Otherwise, you'll be a bit ahead of the times, won't you? I'm your mentor, but you're still mine. Still all mine. <laughs> yeah? What? Looking at me like that. And then what of it? I don't see you complaining or anything. Oh. Well, like I said, a crush is one thing, but I don't know what I feel. I'd like to say I feel just as much as you, but I don't know. You certainly made it a happy birthday, but I don't know. I've got a glass heart, I told you before. I just hope you won't break it. Yeah, maybe I can give you a chance, kid. Guess it depends on how you react. Keep going with those reactions and, well, who's going to stop me? You don't seem like the type. Besides, after today, maybe my crush is a little something more. You never know. Or I guess you could know. If I want you to know, if this confident bastard decides to let you know, <laughs> what, did I make you just a bit flustered? Good, that's just what I do. Now take your flustered little self over here. We've got some cuddling to catch up on. I hope you don't mind. I happen to really look forward to it. You know, for all those lazing hours about wasting time, wasting my life away, I don't regret it. Because you know what? Something about these cuddles. I bet you thought I was going to say it made it all worth it. Maybe. Maybe you'll get lucky and I'll say that someday, but I can't give things to you that easy. Nah. What kind of a mysterious... Roguish man would I be if I said that? Nah. I've got to keep my air of mystery, don't I? Now just shut up and cuddle with me. How about that? 